Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am gonna show you how to make this colorful, fun backdrop for just a few dollars. We are talking about giant pinwheels that you can make for one dollar. Stay tuned, I'm gonna walk you through it. I'm Sarah, this is Creative Ramblings, where I share simple, inspiring projects and recipes every week. If that sounds like something you wanna see, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a video. In today's tutorial, we are talking all about pinwheels, specifically these giant pinwheels right here. These pinwheels are made with the same technique as smaller pinwheels, just like this. This pinwheel here in my hand is made from just a regular piece of cardstock that you can get at the craft store. And these pinwheels right here are made from poster board. I'm gonna walk you through step by step how to make a pinwheel and then show you how to create a backdrop like this that you can use at your next party. I've shared some pinwheel projects before. If you wanna know how to make a pinwheel that actually spins, check out this video right here where I show you how to make a double pinwheel and how you can put it on a stick and make it spin. You are gonna start with a piece of poster board, a yardstick, scissors, hot glue gun, a piece of sparkly paper, and a circle punch. You're also gonna need a pencil for this project. Now your poster board should measure about 22 inches one way. And we wanna cut so it's 22 inches the other way as well, essentially making yourself a large square. So mark it off at 22 inches, draw a nice straight line, and then just cut that extra piece off. When you're making any pinwheel, you always want to start with a square of paper, whether it's 22 inches large or just a four inch square. Next, we're going to take that yardstick and we're going to draw a line from corner to corner. And then we're gonna repeat this step and draw a line between the other two corners. And these are going to be the lines that you're going to cut on. Now we don't wanna cut all the way through. We wanna know where to stop. So right in the middle, about two inches from the middle, we wanna mark a little line and that's where we're gonna stop cutting. So two inches from the center on both of the lines that you just drew. So now that we've got everything marked off, we're just going to cut those lines right up to the marks that you made so that our pinwheel still stays attached. All right, now it's time to assemble it. So grab that hot glue gun. We're going to grab one corner and fold it down to the middle and secure it with just a little bit of hot glue. Hold it in place with your fingers until it's secure. Now you're gonna repeat this around the pinwheel until you have four flaps of your triangles glued to the center. Now to finish off the pinwheel, we're gonna use um, a sparkly piece of paper, just like this one here, and I'm gonna cut it with a two inch circle punch. Now you could finish this off with pom-poms or buttons, whatever you like. For this project, I chose some nice sparkly cardstock. And I'm just gonna secure this with a little hot glue to the center. And that is your pinwheel. Now it's time to hang this on the wall and make a beautiful primary color party backdrop. That's how easy it is to make a paper pinwheel. You can make giant pinwheels just like this, or smaller versions like these over here. My favorite way to use pinwheels is to make them in a lot of different colors and sizes and group them together on a wall like this and you have an awesome party backdrop. If you like this tutorial, let me know in the comments down below and please give me a thumbs up while you're down there. Subscribe to Creative Ramblings for more simple, inspiring projects, and you will find new videos right here every week. This video right up here is something you are going to want to see. Thanks so much for watching, everybody.
Bye bye Want more simple, inspiring projects? Be sure to follow Creative Ramblings over on Instagram. I've got behind-the-scenes stories and sneak peeks of my projects up every day.